Minecraft shaders. A very unique way to customize your game. But with so many to choose from, it can be hard sometimes. In today's video, I have found the top 3 MCPE shaders. Make sure to watch the very end of the video. Hey, what is up guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you the top 3 MCPE shaders from Minecraft Pocket Edition. These do work for Console Edition 2 and Windows 10, but I'm going to be showing you some of them on Minecraft Pocket Edition, guys. And these run on low-end devices and give you no lag whatsoever, guys. So if you do enjoy the video, please make sure to hit that like button and that red Red subscribe button it's free and it's easy and it takes two seconds guys and i'm trying to hit 100k subscribers by the end of this year which we can absolutely do boys without further ado let's continue straight on to the video okay guys so number three on our list we have the noob shaders as you can see this is a pretty low end shaders and a pretty basic one so if you have a low end device this one's perfect for you our other two shaders on today's list are pretty intense and crazy but um yeah this one's kind of cool i like how basic it is as you guys can see, they added some clouds and like gave them a Gaussian blur, so it kind of looks more like realistic and kind of cool. And then you got the sun over there with a the little glow, and I just like everything overall. It like has a nice little tint to it and like a little glow. Everything like, you know what I'm saying? Like Minecraft isn't usually th like this. It's kind of like um everything's a little brighter and more clear. So I really like it, and it's pretty nice if you just kind of want to do like role playing too. Or something pretty basic so i really like this guys let's go ahead and head over to our number two and one spot those ones are pretty intense okay guys so number two on our list is the vert v 1.2 shaders this one's actually a little bit more intense so if you guys like this one you'll love the number one spot guys but as you can see everything kind of has a little glow oh, i forgot to turn off clouds but they don't really have any clouds um it's just kind of like a blank sky so if you like that that's perfect for you and then the the sun's kind of glowing it's not a circle sun but it kind of glows around the whole horizon and everything even if you're not looking at it but when you are it kind of goes away so it's pretty nice it doesn't like just take up your whole screen and then i like how all the blocks are glowing i know a lot of people really really want all the blocks to glow so there you go all the blocks are glowing actually you guys and then um um yeah all the blocks are glowing you can see shadows that's what i was looking for there we go we got the shadows over here so all the blocks do have shadows and they do glow do the leaves move let's see okay the leaves don't move but that's pretty good and so it doesn't take off that much lag and run your device all a bunch but um yeah look at the water the water looks nice the water moves a little bit they're moving the water a little bit I was in the middle because i really like it but it doesn't have that much detail to it so if you do have a low-end device but still want your game to look really cool this is a really good one for you guys but the number one spot is really good and you'll love it and it does run on most low-end devices but if you have like an ipod from like 2005 it's probably not gonna run it but yeah guys but if you like this one smash that like button that red subscribe button it's free and it's easy and it takes two seconds and you guys can always unsubscribe anytime and i would really appreciate it but let's head over to our number one spot <laughs> okay guys for our number one spot we have the big Q shaders high beta as you can see this one has everything to it as you can see the blocks have an amazing glow to them and they have the saturation turned on as you can see there are some like like nice um shadows to them and the leaves are kind of circular a bit in some angles if you look at it it's kind of like a new leaf texture and yeah i think it's beautiful oh look how nice the ocean looks because the ocean does move a little bit as you can see the ocean moves and they gave it a new texture but wow that's so nice you can actually see through the ocean all the lights glowing because it has dynamic lighting and then when you go under the water you can see everything that's so nice guys but i do love the shadows and the sun and the sky that's always my favorite part saturation shadows and glow and i like the sky i love the clouds it looks so beautiful and so realistic and then the sun's circular and i really like when the sun's like that because it's just more realistic and it glows guys and it's just so nice it, like just all around genuinely looks really nice and my phone's not even lagging so it's probably not even gonna lag you so i highly recommend checking this one out guys this is the number one spot but that's going to actually end off today's video, guys. So if you do enjoy this video, please make sure to hit that like button and that red subscribe button. But I'm going to wrap up today's video. So I'll catch you guys in the next video. Happy birthday if it is your birthday. And peace out.